Glendale, Arizona. My name is Dave Stevens, along with my partner, Mike Steele. I'm looking at coaching staffs today, Dave. Two coaches who aren't afraid to play ball. Deep passes, trick plays, jailbreak blitzes. We're sure to see them all today. Mike, you know, I wonder if the crowd here isn't thinking the exact thing. Well, let's get right to the action. Wilson takes the kick. He dodges away. They'll start things off from the 25. Smith with the handoff. That gets us to second down. Second down for Nebraska. <laughs> McCoy takes the ball. That gets us to third down. Third down. <laughs> the pitch is taken by number 29. Fourth down. Sometimes it's a good strategy to play the field position game. Get yards when you can and hope for a good stop on defense so you can give it another go closer to the end zone. He punts it away. The kick is caught at the 17-yard line. This drive will begin from the 26. <laughs> Makes the reception. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. <laughs> McCormick steps back into the pocket. Caught. Hands it to number 23. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. He continues to move the chains and keep this drive alive. McCormick lining up under center. McCormick hands it off. Handing it off to number 23. That gets us to third down. A crucial third down for the offense. Handing it off to number 23. That brings up fourth down. That's a safe play on third down. When you've got a long way to go, sometimes you're better off just picking up a few yards and kicking it. Go. McKinney makes the kick, and he makes it from 28 yards out. Arizona takes the initial lead. Three, nothing. The defense isn't happy about falling behind, but they have to feel good about holding them to a field goal. McKinney kicks it. Wilson takes the kickoff. Tackled after a return of 24. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Nebraska begins the drive from the 26. Go. Brady on the carry. That gets us to second down. Second down. That signals the end of the first quarter. The Heat with the lead so far. Three, nothing. Z 
tonight. The QB heads it off. That gets us to third down. Tight end on the right side. He makes the pitch, shaking off the tackler. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. He continues to move the chains and keep this drive alive. First down. <laughs> Dropping back. He hurls one. Incomplete pass. As a QB, your guys have to help you out. Sure, bad throws happen, but when it hits your hands, you have to make the play. Hike. Smith makes the pitch. Smith with the top. That brings up fourth down. That's a smart play call. You were in a bad position on third down. Take a few yards and live to fight another day. Blair on the punt. The punt will sail into the end zone and will be brought out to the 20-yard line. The offense has a one-possession lead going into the drive. Let's see what they can do with it. First down. There's a flag on the field. Nebraska takes the penalty. He just needs to shake it off and get back to doing what he does best. A fresh set of downs for the offense. Tonight. McCormick on the play action. The pass is caught by number 38. That gets us to second down. When you throw passes with that much heat, it makes it hard for the receiver to catch, but also for the defender to pick it off. Makes the handoff to number 23. Nebraska will call their first time out here. That gets us to third down. He's hit hard and he'll be sacked down at the 20 yard line. Nebraska uses their second timeout. That'll bring up fourth down. The defense was expecting pass the whole way. The safeties and corners had the top covered, which left that short pass as the only option. The kick is caught at the 34. This is a good position for offense to be in. It's a one-score game, and they've got a good opportunity to go down the field and get some points. Penalty marker on the field. Rockets walk along the sideline. He safely steps out of bounds up at the 43. Let's see how the penalty affects things. The Thunder will turn down the penalty. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. Back-to-back -back first downs really has an impact on the crowd, too. He launches one to the left side, deep downfield. The receiver can't bring it in. Smith looking to pass. Throws it deep down the field. Incomplete. Smith lining up under center. Smith steps back into the pocket. He steps in for six. Deep strikes for scores is so disheartening to a defense. 
Nebraska lines up for the PAT. Go! There's the kick. It's good. Nebraska will take the lead with that score. Seven, three. A big score there for the offense. They push out front, but there's still plenty of game left. Morrison sends this one deep. Cannon catches the kickoff. Makes the return up to the 11. The home team has to feel good about where they are. They're down by a single score and are in control of what happens next. Arizona starts the drive from the 11. McCormick dropping back. The pass connects with number 16. Second down. Sometimes it's necessary to throw it in there like that to reduce the chance it gets picked off. McCormick drops back. He rockets a pass out to the right side of the field. Now, when you want to get the ball into your receiver's hands quickly, that's the kind of throw you want from your quarterback. A fresh set of downs for the offense. McCormick looking to pass. Second down. Fourth play of the drive for Arizona. Drops back into the pocket. Throws one over to the right side. He can't bring it in. McCormick with the handoff. That brings up fourth down. That's a safe play on third down. When you've got a long way to go, sometimes you're better off just picking up a few yards and kicking it. That marks the end of the second quarter. Nebraska up so far. Seven, three. Boots this one into the end zone. Cannon takes the kick. Tackled after a return of 18. Let's head down to Emma Adams on the field. Emma, what can you tell us? Gentlemen, I had a chance to talk with the coach for the Heat. He seemed a bit frustrated. He said he was happy that his team's going into the second half with a lead, but the mental errors that they made in the first half could come back to haunt them. Guys, back to you. We appreciate the update, Emma. Second and short. <laughs> Pitches it out to number 23. That'll be enough for the first down. When you can pick up the first by running, it really opens up your playbook for the next set of downs. McCormick dropping back. Number 16 catches it. Some throws require touch and some require zip. That, my friend, was a rocket shot. Second down. <laughs> McCormick tosses one out. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. Tight end right for Arizona. Hike. Throws a fastball. And that's enough for a first down. Good. McCormick looking to pass. Complete to number 38. When you can keep the sticks moving quickly like that, it's a good way to build momentum on a drive. The tight end lines up on the right side. He steps back to pass. That gets us to second down.
Strike. Throws it deep. Down. Intercepted by number 41. The tight end was in the right place at the right time for that interception. The offense will be looking to turn that turnover into points on this drive. The offense will begin the drive from the 20-yard line. The handoff is taken by number 29, second down. Second play of the drive for the Thunder. Smith hands it off. That'll be enough for the first down. Excellent footwork on that run to pick up the first down. The Thunder comes out with two backs. Dropping back. Wilson makes the reception. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. As good as advertised, Dave. We expected to see some great offense today, and it's coming around. The third quarter comes to an end. Nebraska with the lead so far. Seven, three. The away team with two receivers. Incomplete. Second down. Tonight, Smith on the play action. That gets us to third down. Tonight. Smith steps back into the pocket. Caught by number 29, fourth down. The punt's away, and the kick lands out of bounds close to the 36-yard line. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Tonight. McCormick hands it off. That gets us to second down. Second down for the Heat. Go! McCormick handing it off. Third down. Hey. McCormick looking to pass. The ball falls to the ground. Incomplete. Dropping back, Rockets one, makes the catch, and that's enough for a first down. From under center, McCormick drops back, tosses a pass, the pass connects with number 12, that will move the chains Quick first downs like that keep the defense guessing. He drops back. Throws a pass out to the sideline. The ball falls to the ground. Incomplete. Second down. Dropping back, sets his feet and throws to the right side of the field. Third down. Bullet passes are so hard, Dave. That's when I knew I was done with the game, when I only had one or two of those per game left in the tank.
Makes the handoff to number 23, and that's enough for a first down. Blocking can be one of the more overlooked aspects of running, but their impact on that first down run was pretty evident. McCormick with the handoff. That brings up second down. Lining up on second down. McCormick hands it off. That brings up third down. Two receivers for Arizona. He drops back to pass. He muscles one over to the left side. And he can't reel it in. McCormick back to pass. Fourth down stops like that can really change the momentum in a game. It's basically like forcing a turnover. This drive will begin from the 19. Shakes off the defender. Arizona calls timeout. Second down. Second play of the drive. He makes the handoff. Arizona takes their third timeout. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. You see those big linemen starting to put hands on the hips, getting a bit tired of staying on the field. Arizona will take their third and final timeout here. That will bring up second down. That brings up third down. That'll bring up fourth down. I think that's a good call by the coach. There's still a lot of game left, and you don't want to force things and make a mistake here. Okay, Mike. Well, we've waited all game. Let's hear who the stud of the game is. This is a clear choice for me today. I'm selecting Franklin for the away team. A well-executed day for him.